Okay, another property sa parallelogram. Uh, next tayo, if a quadrilateral is a parallelogram, then its consecutive angles are supplementary. So, meron tayo ditong A, B, C, D na parallelogram. So, ang consecutive ay si A ni B, and consecutive din si B ni C, at si C ni D, consecutive din yan, and D ni A. Now, Meron tayong given dito na angle A is equal to 2x plus 25 degrees. I mean, plus 25 in degrees and 3x minus 5 in degrees. First, hanapin natin yung value dyan ng x. Then, to solve for the value of x, uh, sinasabi ng properties na yung angle, consecutive angles, are supplementary. So, si angle A plus angle B is equal now to 180 degrees. Dahil ang supplementary is uh, 180 degrees in measure. Since yung given sa angle A natin dito is 2x plus 25, and plus yung angle B natin is 3x minus 5, is equal now to 180. Then, i-add lang natin lahat ng like terms sa left side. 2x plus uh, 3x is equal to is equal to 5x. Then, uh, 25 minus 5 is 20. Is equal to 180 degrees. Then, lipat natin si 20 doon, magiging minus 20. And, we have 5x is equal to 160. And, di-divide natin both side by 5. So, cancel. Then, x now is equal to 32. Then, the value of x is 32. Then, to solve, Uh, the measurement of angle A, uh, just substitute the given expression, uh, 2x plus 25, then 2 times 32 plus 25, then 2 times 32, 64 plus 25, then is equal now to 89 degrees, si angle A is 89 degrees. And, si angle uh, B is equal to 3x minus 5. Substitute natin si 32 sa x. 3 times 32 minus 5 is equal now to... Okay, 3 times 32 is 96 minus 5. Now, okay, si 96 minus 5. Ang sagot natin is 91. Now, ito yung measurement ni angle B. Then, when we add the angle A plus angle B is equal to 180. So, add natin 89 degrees plus 91 degrees is equal to 180. Then, 180, itong sum nito, is equal now to 180 degrees. Kaya, ibig sabihin, tama yung sukat natin, na 89 si A, uh, si angle A at 91 angle B at may value tayo rito ng X na 32.